For the first delivery, we will only cover 70% of the delivery fee, and you will cover for 30% of the delivery fee, which is $50. This only applies for the first delivery. Subsequently, as from the second month, we will be covering all the delivery fees. You will be receiving our products every month for 12 months to use and make posts. Hello everyone, I'm Daniel. Welcome to today's video. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. It's not going to be about fashion. It is about the fact that I almost got scammed. It is about online influencer scams. Before I get started, I just want to give you guys a little bit of my update. If you haven't seen my last video, I just talked to you guys about I'm currently doing a master degrees starting from August. So right now it is the 19th of August. It's been two months. It's been very, very busy. I don't have a lot of time because it is a full-time program. So basically I need to study from Monday to Friday in the evening. And in case you don't know, I'm also a part-time English teacher at the moment. I have to teach three classes each week. So I have to study, I have to go to work. I've been very, very busy, so I don't have a lot of time to update my YouTube channels. Actually, I filmed a Celine Sango review a couple months ago, and I still haven't had a chance to edit it. Hopefully, finger crossed, if I have time, I'm going to edit the video and upload it on my YouTube channel as soon as possible. The reason why I want to film this video is because I don't want other influencers or other people got scammed because I almost got scammed. It is crazy because I've been posting pictures on my Instagram six years ago. So I've been doing it for six years. I've collaborated with different brands. If I see it is a scam, I will just skip it. I will not pay attention to it because I know it is a scam. But for this one, it is a little bit tricky. I really almost got scammed. So I really want to share what is going on. And I just want to make sure you guys know what is happening right now. Anyway, I just don't want you guys to get scammed. So for my usual videos, I usually film using my phone. But this time I just use my laptop using Zoom to film this video because it's going to be a lot more convenient. Anyway, so let's get into it. A couple of days ago, I got an email from Shein. Someone is impersonating Shein. I've also done some research and find out that someone is also impersonating other fashion brand like Fashion Nova, not just Shein. I'm gonna put a screenshot somewhere on the screen. Maybe I'm gonna also put it in the description box as well. And I'm gonna read the email right now. So the title of the email is for collaborations. Good day. We she in are launching our newest clothing brand and you're recommended by community. After going through a social media page, we've served your profile and you qualify for collaboration with us. However, you will need to follow the steps before you begin collaborating with us. Since we're just launching our influencer campaign and we want to involve, you will get number one, three monthly packages, eight items of a choice per month, your ring exclusive discount code to share, shout outs and repost to our Instagram and website. We'll be sending you our PR packages every month. This means you'll get to show off our newest item completely free, with no catch. In return, just tell us with the clothing by either wearing them or just showing off our package. Every time you post a show out of our newest brand, we'll usually start with a payment of 1000 per post, which can also be negotiated if you meet the criteria. We will increase this fee as you get more popular and we make more from, our, from your posts and you wearing our clothes and posting them on your social media pages. Not gonna lie, when I first read this email, I wasn't really paying much attention to it because now I think about it, there are so many problems by just looking at this email. First of all, this email just poorly written. There is no greeting and not even my name. It is a business email and not just business email. Any email you will have your name, there's no name. I don't even know who is the one who's sending this email to me. I only know that his email is from Shein. I'm not sure which person from Shein is sending me this email. And then I just respond by saying, feel free to send me more details regarding the collaborations. They reply, Again, there's no proper greeting. In this email, basically, they're telling me um, I'm going to be receiving uh, collaborations 
registration link very soon. I didn't pay much attention to it, but if you're a brand and you're reaching out to someone, you wouldn't ask them to sign up for the collaborations because the brand must have done the research. So you don't need to fill in the information, I guess. The scammer is just trying to make it look authentic by sending me a Shein link. The link is really from Shein, but after I Google it and I find out that this link is actually, yeah, it is really from Shein, but it is, the website is called She Glam Inferenza, something along those lines, I can't remember. And it is for beauty inferenza. Wow. Weird, right? But although they're sending me a link, but actually it is for beauty inferenza. It's not for fashion inferenza. It is something that you might have to have a look at, even though they might be sending you some, some sort of, you know, something that look very authentic. But actually, if you really look into it, it's not the case. And then a day later, I got an email from Jack. So he is the human resource manager at Shein. He's using the same email they used to contact me. And he was just telling me, congratulations, you successfully completed your collaboration applications and asking me if I wanted to be the influencers. And then he sent another email telling me I can pick eight items from the website and then have to give in some sort of information my full name my address my contact details my bank details or preferred method of receiving the payments and then here comes to the very juicy part for the first delivery we will only cover 70 percent of the delivery fee and you will cover for 30 percent of the delivery fee which is 50 dollars this only applies for the first delivery. Subsequently, as from the second month, we will be covering all the delivery fees. You will be receiving our products every month for 12 months to use and make posts. For the first delivery, I need to pay. I mean, it's not an issue, but in the past, 95% of the time, when a band reach out to me and want to collaborate with me, I usually don't need to pay for the delivery. I mean, it's completely fine. Um, I have brand that I collaborate before. I still need to pay for the delivery fee, but that is when the delivery guy delivered directly to my apartment. And then when I received the package, I have to pay to the delivery guy at that moment when i when i saw first saw the video i think mm, of course it is fine because at the end of the day it's just delivery fee it is all right i'm gonna pay when i receive the package and then after i sending him the information which is just yesterday let's have a look at his email sorry for the delay we have received your locations and contact information we'll forward the delivery details to fact as delivery service there are delivery partners. In this case, Zell is our preferred method of payment. Please make payments to our USA Logistics Managers, Zell. Tag below and then the email address. When you're done with the payment, please send a screenshot of your payment so we can confirm and deliver the package to me. Best regards, Shein. And then he sent me one more email. Sorry, this is PayPal tag. The Zell written above is a typographical error. Thank you for understanding. There are lots of red flag in this email. First of all, I've said I prefer to pay via PayPal. And they respond to the email by saying Zelle. Secondly, which is the most important part, which is the most obvious one, I have to pay for the delivery fee beforehand by sending the money to the email address above. It is not even a company email, which is very dodgy. And then do you know what? After I got this email, I know for sure that it is a scam. And then I've done some research on the internet and find out that 
not only me and other people also came across this sort of problem as well and it's not just for Shein so there's another company called Fashion Nova it also happened to this kind of problem as well that's about it I didn't get scammed because I know for sure it is a scam I didn't lose anything it's just that I wanted to let you guys know that it is something that's happening to not just regular people it happens to influencers as well so if you're influencers you have to pay extra attention to it but there are some points i would like to talk about this sort of problem wouldn't happen to you first of all you need to have a look at a company email the one who is sending me the email it is not even from Shein. you have to pay attention to the company address to make sure that it is really from that company. Secondly, you need to pay attention to what a business email should look like. You know, it is just very weird the way they talk to me. It is, it is just like a robot. It is not like a human at all. But you have to pay attention to what a business email should look like. And thirdly, which is uh, again, it's the most important thing, do you need to pay anything before your collaborations? Normally, I would say if you need to pay for anything before your collaborations, it is a sign. It is a sign that could be a scam. And if you think it could be the case, please do some research and look for anything to see if it is a scam. The fourth, again, is also very important ask any questions to clarify if you're uncomfortable just don't do the collaborations if you feel uncomfortable just talk to the brand directly if you have anything in mind that you think you makes makes you feel uncomfortable if a brand is really wanted to collaborate with you they will listen to you just answer your questions please do ask questions if you feel uncomfortable Thank you for watching this video and I hope this video is going to be useful. If something like this ever happened to you before, please leave a comment down below and share your experience and I would love to know more about it. Hopefully, I'm going to be seeing you guys in another video very soon. Bye-bye.